Greetings friends and my valued viewers welcome back to our YouTube channel preferably you are fine like before enormous news for dinar just dropped I by and large endeavor my best to give you the revived information so this video is about the latest announcement monetary reform released new exchange rate. Hit become involved with stay informed and comment the discussion surrounding the impact of the recent ALAC meeting in the United States on Iraq's currency rate reveals a nuanced understanding of the complex interplay between monetary policy, banking stability, and international relations. While some argue that such meetings have minimal immediate effect on exchange rates, others believe they are crucial for setting the stage for future monetary reforms. This dichotomy highlights the multifaceted nature of currency valuation and economic reform. International meetings, such as the one involving Iraq's central bank governor, ALAC, in the United States, play a pivotal role in the broader context of monetary reform, even if they do not directly result in an immediate change in the exchange rate. These meetings are essential for several reasons. They provide a platform for dialogue between Iraqi officials and international financial institutions, including the International Monetary Fund, IMF, and World Bank, which are instrumental in guiding and supporting economic reforms. Such gatherings offer opportunities to discuss and align on critical aspects of monetary policy and economic stability. They serve as a forum to address issues such as fiscal discipline, anti corruption measures and the implementation of effective financial systems are all of which are crucial for creating a conducive environment for currency reform. One of the key points raised is the need for banking stability and security. For a new exchange rate to be successful, Iraq's banking sector must be robust and resilient. This means that banks need to be free from corruption and capable of effectively managing new monetary policies. The stability of the banking sector is crucial because it directly affects public confidence and the overall effectiveness of monetary policy. A stable banking environment ensures that financial transactions are secure, and it supports the smooth implementation of new exchange rates and monetary measures. Furthermore, the fight against corruption within the banking sector and the broader financial system is essential. Corruption can undermine the integrity of financial institutions, distort economic policies, and deter foreign investment. By addressing these issues, Iraq can create a more transparent and trustworthy financial system, which is vital for the both domestic and international confidence in the new exchange rate. Another important consideration is the impact of international sanctions. Sanctions can significantly affect a country's economic environment, including its ability to engage in international financial markets and implement effective monetary reforms. Alleviating or lifting sanctions can facilitate a more favorable environment for currency reform. Sanctions relief can improve access to international financial systems, attract foreign investment, and enhance economic stability all of which are beneficial for the successful implementation of a new exchange rate. While it's unlikely that the meeting in New York will immediately announce a new exchange rate, it is a crucial step in the preparation process. Meetings like these help outline and prepare the necessary groundwork for future reforms. They ensure that the steps leading up to a new exchange rate are carefully planned and executed. This includes ensuring that financial institutions are ready, that anti-corruption measures are in place, and that the overall economic environment is conducive to supporting a new rate. Thank you for watching, and if you have any questions or need further clarification on any of these points, please let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more updates on the Iraqi dinar and other financial news. Until next time, take care and stay informed.